Hey guys, now let's start our new topic and that is cable compartment. So the cable compartment houses some of the following components. Post insulator, feeder earthing switch and it could be optional. Voltage transformer, it could be optional. It, it might be present, might not be present. Earthing bus bar, operating shaft for feeder, earthing switch, high voltage cables, ring core, current transformer. This is the picture of cable com typical cable compartment. In this picture, you can see the item number one is post insulator. Item number two is feeder earthing switch. This is the earthing switch of the feeder. If you move this one up, the cable side will be grounded. Then we have option number three, voltage transformer. So here you can see there are three transformers connected to the line side, which are the basically VTs or voltage transformers. Then you can see earthing bus bar at number 4. This is the earthing bus bar. You can call it also as a common earthing script. Sometimes it's called. This is available here. So each equipment earthing is connected here. Then you have operating shaft for feeder earthing switch at number 5. This is the operating shaft which is number 5 is used for operating feeder earth switch. This is the earth switch number 2 and this is the rod. If you move this rod, this earth switch will move up and, and as a result it will ground the feeder. Number 6 is high voltage cables. This is the number 6. And you can see the cables are connected to this copper bar. Ring core current transformer. So number 7 is current transformers. So here you can see these are the ring core current transformers. And this is you can see here the secondary winding of current transformers. So these are the parts of cable compartment. I hope you enjoy this lecture. Thank you very much.